Equations similar to these come up in differential equations. To get y by itself, we're going to need to get rid of that one-third and get rid of the natural log. We can get rid of the one-third by multiplying both sides of the equation by 3. We can get rid of the natural log by using this rule. We have a to the log base a of x is just x. So our base for natural log is e. So we're going to exponentiate both sides of the equation with e as the base. So e to the ln of y gives us the y. For the right side, we're going to use this rule here, that if we have a sum in our exponent, we can change that to multiplication. So this is e to the 3 ln of x times e to the 3c. I would like to get this x down. We have an e and an ln of x. However, we have that 3 in the front, so we can't use that rule. So let's get rid of that 3, or move it anyway, uh, using this rule. If we have a number times a log, you can put that number up as the exponent. So we'll have y equals e to the natural log of x cubed times e to the 3c. And now we can use this rule. So we'll have x cubed times e to the 3c.